Oh shoot! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. Tonight we are in Nepal. New map out for Collar Hunter, Collar Hunter, for the Hunter Call of the Wild, and this is um, their Nepalese map, including yes, you can actually hunt tigers. So that's going to be exciting. We're going to go on a hunt and see what we can find on our first hunt out. We're kind of in the middle of the map, and um, you can see all these regions here. They look like, obviously, you have huge mountains. And you have, there's some valleys, and like river valleys and stuff, and they've kind of tried to make this as much like a miniature version of Nepal as possible. Um, but it's a, a really cool reserve, and uh, it looks pretty neat. So... First things first, I need to get uh, limbered up with weapons here. Um, I have picked. Oh, yeah, they got black buck. The same thing as uh, you can get those in Africa or er, South America. Also, they're pretty cool. They're like almost like gazelle. But I've got a full range of hunting weapons to go hunting. So we're going to put these in. I got my yellow jacket, which covers size one to two. I've got my Mosinagot, which covers two to six or three to seven. I'm sorry. And then seven to nine is going to be our 338. Um, and that is a very large round. But we need it because there are buffalo and stuff on this map. And of course, the tigers. You want to take them down pretty quick. So um, I want a big round. And that rifle, I think they call it a Lapu. Is it Lapua? Is that what that's called? That round? Anyway, it's a big round. Uh, consumables lures. We've got. Some kind of animal called a Barashinga? Nilgai? I don't know what that is. Probably some kind of deer. Um, obviously, this is the tiger collar. This will call hog deer, Java, and Rusa on sandbar. I don't know if we have any of those on this map, but we'll throw it in there just in case. And I have a roe deer collar. There you go. But that also calls our northern red monk jack, which probably is a some sort of roe deer or red deer species or roe deer species. And so let's go ahead and get out there and see what we see. Black buck I'm not super excited about catching because we have some of those. Though I don't know that I have any in any of my, like saved in any of my um, hunting lodges. There he is right there. Oh, there's a water buffalo. That's not a black buck. Two females. Probably not going to go. At, we'll go after one, but not those two, I don't think. And we need to move downwind, but I'll get around the outside of this building and see what we see. So Nilgai, Nilgai, there's an 86. We have a 91 there. Now, he won't be. they won't be 91. The way that the game works is that usually you're right between the two scores. So it gives you a range, and it doesn't do a great job differentiating the actual range. It'll just, it'll just plunk it in. <laughs> no. 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 Go sit down. Good boy. <laughs> I thought it was the gray one in back. Also, but I don't know. It's it. The numbers aren't coming up the way that they were. Whoa, glitch. What the? Back off. Back off. Oh, no, that's an 83. 84. Okay, they're moving around. 91. So it's this. Nope. It's this dark brown one. Right? Nope. <laughs> Who the heck is reading 91? Oh, and I can't even tell because now they're glitching. Oh, this game. Okay, I'm just going to take this guy right here. Perfect shot right there. And he's probably going to go down pretty quick, I would imagine. Yep, he's dead. So, our first nil guy. That's a weird noise. What was that? So, this is a... Um, once again, this is a Mosin. Um, 
Beresinga. Beresinga? Beresinga. Definitely a good hit. And uh, yes, this is an old school rifle. The question is, it looks like an old school rifle. This is a Mosinagot, which is a 7.62 by 5.4 round. It's a Russian World War II rifle. And um, no, this has been in the game for a long time. Uh, the DLC is new, though. We are here in Nepal once again. Sorry for those of you on YouTube. I'm talking to the, the Twitch chat. So, there's our first animal. I think this is our 91 range nil guy. It's a gold rating. Yeah, that would be it. 94 is diamond, so he was about 10 off. So, there we go. Pretty cool looking. I probably, wow, is expensive. To, the taxidermy prices, I feel like they went up. Oh, they can be hunted in Texas, too, apparently. Good, good eaten. Well, let's go ahead and taxidermy this gold one for now. I don't usually do golds. I try to save diamonds, but I'd like to have at least one of each animal in my lodges. So that we'll use him as a, as a sample. And we will continue our hunt. We got another nil guy here. Oh, whoa, he, oh man, he turned. I could have had a shot on him. They keep, I want to. Hmm. <laughs> They're not sure. And they shouldn't be because there's a guy running around shooting them. And that should have taken him down. Let's go see what we got. Definitely got an organ on that shot. Let's see what we got. Yeah, it makes a big splatter. Lions, tigers, and bears. Oh, my. I brought this in case of tigers. It's a 338. We'll definitely do a tiger in. Man, that shot them. These are pretty big animals, though. They're size six, and I'm shooting them with a two to six round. So really, a four to eight would probably be a, would be a better round to shoot them with, but it'll still do the job, and it's full score. So there we go. There's another one. I'm not going to keep him, and he was only a silver. So not quite. So 86, that was his 79, not quite as nice. But still, a thousand bucks, not bad. Good old Mosin. There we go, ladies and gentlemen, our first tar. Let's see if we can get him. He's, he's a size four, so the Mosin is what we're going to be using to shoot him with. Um, let's get let's get him. Uh, sight him up. Three one sixty four. Oh yeah, put him right down. That's probably a hard shot right there. Let's go take a look at this animal. He looks pretty cool. So that was a really good shot. Luck, partly. I mean, I always try to hit their heart, but... So he's basically like... Thank you, honey. He's basically like a fuzzy goat. Kind of ugly. <laughs> Silver. Yeah. Not worth... So let's look at the scores. So over 101 is a diamond. Gold is 84. Um, I won't taxidermy this one, but we'll, we'll try to keep looking for one to taxidermy because I do. Once again, I like to have one of each. And then if I get a diamond, I'll replace them with a diamond. But uh, let's see. It's kind of a cool looking animal. Definitely a goat family type. Animal with cloven hooves. <laughs> All right. Keep going towards the lake. We are really high above the lake. Oh, I'm hearing another animal. What do we got? Oh, woolly hares. I'm not too worried about the hair. I, I never do rabbit hunting. I probably should at some point. It's like in my life, I don't have time. <laughs> the rabbits are you pretty easy. You just get a shotgun, set up a stand near their zone. They'll run away, and then you just hang out there. 
and they'll keep coming back because they're pretty stupid. They don't they don't seem to notice people hanging around them. And we're gonna switch over to the to walk mode because I'm getting pretty close to the lake and I don't want to scare the animals away. <laughs> you can use the duck blind to hunt bison, yeah. All right, so let's see what we find down here. So pretty. I love the cherry trees. If that's what they are. Cherry blossoms, maybe. Okay, we've got a tar right up here on the ridge. We'll call this tar ridge. Where is he? Dang it, he was right here. Urgh, just saw him. Once again, though, very pretty map. This is really nice scenery. Oh, oh. I want to get a reading on him. What is he? He's not a very good score. No, it's not terrible, though, either, but little tiny horns. Not worth shooting, probably. I, I mean, I usually shoot them all because it's supposed to respawn you with bigger animals when you do it. Let's see how far he goes. It's about 100 yards. No, he's still going. <laughs> he's out of here. He shoots. He scores. He's out of here. All the way home. He ran all the way home. Dang it. So for watching, if you're watching on YouTube, we have just come to the first thing that I've seen. This is kind of cool. Uh, for those of you on Twitch, you've already seen this, but this is a house that's also an outpost. That's the first time I've seen one that's both, and I love that. Man, this would be cool. This would be really cool to stay in. In Amish country, um, we have a company called, uh, what's it called? Koblenz cabins and uh, oh, I'm scared a water buffalo off and um, Koblenz cabins ha cabins cabins has these uh, tree house uh, Amish cabins that you can rent and they're so cool like it's just like this but it, it, it's like a cabin you have a but they're luxurious they have like a, like a like one, a hot tub with like a waterfall um, into it <laughs> like out in the middle of the room and it's just it's really nice they're 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 really nicely done but they're also like three hundred dollars a night i think we have everything we need to hunt so <laughs> actually though you know what now that we're here i talked about getting a rifle so let's take a look real quick at our loadout and um probably get rid of that this has been an i'm gonna try to move some things we need this for big animals uh, let's see. I want to get a little bit larger rifle. Remington. I don't, they have a, a seven millimeter. They call it. it. It probably is the Remington 700. Uh, we'll grab one of these. That's a 308. So I got a 308. I've got a 338. Um, and I want a shotgun. Because they seem to have a lot of like shotgun sized animals. Seven millimeter. Yeah, the, is the cartridge for the 700. Yeah. Yep. Um, so we got, what do we got? 12, 20 gauge. The Artisan is the one I really like. The Artisan. Is that 20 gauge? That's a, that's a small shotgun, though. But that's okay. We don't really need a big one. Whew, that pushed us right to the limit of carrying capacity. All right, so we need to drop off some rounds and get the right mounds. There's no 8 millimeter. I don't believe we have a Mauser, no. Um, there's a British Enfield, and then there's also the, the Soviet rifle that we were using, the that, that one. But no Mauser. Okay. So to match those guns, I need to get 20 gauge birdshot, <laughs> buckshot, and slug. And what was the what was the other gun we grabbed? We grabbed the 30, 308. The 308 is going to be our goat gun. Polymer tip. There we go. And so we are looking at 27, 22.73 of 23. Good Lord. All right. So now we can do our, our inventory real quick here. We're just going to put, we'll put the 338 as our biggest gun that's already there. I need a 308. And the rifle. And so the shotgun. So we're going to put the 308 rounds in that. Sights. We're going to use this. That already has a sight on it. 
And then for the ammo, I'm going to load. For now, we're going to load Birdshot. Birdshot. Because mostly I am going to use it to hunt birds. And there's no, I'm not going to use a scope on it. Maybe I should. What sights do I have for the shotgun? Um, let's see. Storage. Hang on. We'll be back, folks. Be very quiet. Oh, I think I see him. Got him. Pow. All right, what's that fling? Oh, we just scared off the black buck again. Dang it. I've been chasing that guy for a little while. Keep getting a little rabbit. Hi, rabbit. You good little woolly. Oh, poor bunny. Dang it. <laughs> Why do they have to be so cute? Uh, mm. Actually, he has kind of a strange look in his eyes. <laughs> a little disturbing. Hello, I'm a rabbit. <laughs> oh, Lord. She's going to start yapping again. Okay, now we got a black buck. And I don't... He knows we're here, but he's not running yet. We'll hear him... We should hear him flee. Turn my headphones up a little bit. I do... This game's great for headphone usage. Like, I do. I do use... The headphones quite a bit because you can really hear stereo like where the animals are just just buck a scatter shot it'll just work <laughs> just do it <laughs> hold on a second oops I don't think we're going to get this black buck because I can't because I haven't been able to see him yet. I think he'll spot. Oh, I see him now. We got him. Now, whether we got an organ or not, I don't know, but it's buckshot. So usually it kills them anyway. He's off. Uh, no organs hit. Yeah, but that's that's actually not uncommon with buckshot. So let's see what happens. He's bleeding good. He's going to go down. But that sucks because we're not going to get the the bonus. So we're going to lose a percentage off, I think. We'll see. Sometimes the buckshot they don't they don't judge as harshly. Poor little deer. Ooh, that's kind of a cool animal. He's a silver. Nope, we got full full ratings. So when you when you use buckshot, they get rid of that. You must hit an organ. Let's see where it got. So yeah, oh, we we did get the lung. It did get a lung. Okay, it might not have gone all the way through, but I mostly hit him in the. Le wow, that was a pretty bad shot. There you go, Red Alpha. Uh, all right, that's pretty good, man. Look, that's a good looking animal. Not, not anything, not worth keeping for a trophy or anything like that. If it was a gold, I might taxidermy it because I don't have many of these. But yeah, it's an odd spread pattern or just a really crappy shot. All right, so let's head on and see if we can find this supposed tiger, this alleged tiger. Like World War Three. I don't care about the score on this one. It's bleeding. It's gonna bleed out. Oh, oh God! Oh, you went down. Oh, oh God! Jaguars. Yeah, I used up all my rounds. Dang it! <laughs> this is dangerous down here. Dang it! <laughs> if somebody can get a clip of that too, like frick. 
All right, so let's see what this guy was. He's definitely not going to be a trophy. X none. What was he? He was low. No, he's way below. Even a silver. That that was terrifying. Yeah. <laughs> he just came out of nowhere. They don't like anybody being around them. We'll just take it. <laughs> Dang it. Now I'm hurt. Leave me alone. I'm just looking for a tiger, okay? <laughs> Yeah, that's true. They do jump down. That is a water buffalo. Yeah, that that was intense. Okay. Oh. Uh. Literally, the hair is standing up on my arms. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Hmm. <laughs> <gasps> he's right there. Oh God. <laughs> there he is. Oh, he's beautiful. <sighs> he's walking away. Oh no, he's not walking away. No, he's not walking away. He's going to die. I got to wait. I got to wait. I can't get a good hit on him yet. Oh no, don't start running. No, no, no. Bad kitty. Bad. Bad. I think I got him. Oh, fudge nuts. He is dying. He's down to 50% already. 25. He's dead. Oh, God. I got him. <laughs> oh, man. Doesn't mean there's other, not other kitties out here, but that was a good hit. He's down by now. All right. We need to see if we can find that, uh, I'm assuming that was the male that we were chasing, but I don't even know if that was the male or not. All right, where do we... We got him on the... Okay, there he is. Jeez. <laughs> He's so... I can't sleep. <laughs> it is kind of the stuff of nightmares, isn't it, man? Big gun, good hit. All right, let's go find him. He's gorgeous. Oh, he's so expensive to taxidermy, but... I got to taxidermy that one, and then we'll get the female, and I can put the male and female together. That... Look at that. <laughs> it was a perfect shot. It went down pretty quick, so it's about as good as you can ask for. Thank you, TR. Take a look there. Oh, it looks like I got him. Lung. That was really low, actually, but we got him. So, yeah. All right. Let's let's go ahead and taxidermy this. I'm going to keep that. That's, that's a beautiful tiger. My first tiger. Beef. All right. Let's keep moving. That's a nice buffalo. If we could get a good hit on him, I, I'd like to have him. I don't. I think diamond's like 200. I, did you guys remember what the diamond was? That's a big one, though. Look at him shaking those horns. Friggy's gone. He's going to go away. I like the way he flees at like two miles an hour. So we can just call this Death Trap River. Leave me alone. I'm a family man. Go away. Go away. <laughs> oh, God. At least I'm safe in my tent. In real life, you would just bowl the tent right over, but hold still. <laughs> Good night, Beavertown. Uh, come on. Give me. I want, turn so I can hit you. Thank you. Uh. Uh, stupid buffalo. You suck! Idiot. <laughs> He's, it's not going to get me in here, but I just wanted to go away so I can go hunt. It's so angry.
<laughs> I know that's a hole in the tent. <laughs> oh, I missed. That was a big miss. How many holes do you have in you now? Go die. Not enough, apparently. I think I've missed all those shots. I don't know. It doesn't look like it. No, she's still full health. I can't hit her, but she can't hit me. By the way, partial end, welcome. We're going to pause. All right, we've got the great big game gun. Hopefully this will be able to do something. Um... Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Well, that took care of that. Nice gun. This is a big gun. Frig's sake. <laughs> what well, was well, this? Is the female? It's not. She didn't. She won't rate well. Um, we got all the full score on it. Good lord. <sighs> so for the last animal in the game, we're gonna hunt this male munchak, and he's just right there. He's a cute little fella. I probably got him in the neck. I don't think we killed him. <laughs> but maybe. If I did, it will probably not be a good kill. Oh, he's down. I don't know if that was the right size gun, though. I should have checked that. Ugh. Yeah. Oh, that was definitely, <laughs> it was definitely too big of a gun. Um, that better not be a water buffalo. That's another munchak there. Uh, let's see. That was a really quick and easy kill. Wrong ammo size. What is this? What's he supposed to be here? Um, oh, God. Why don't you leave me alone? One, two, three. Okay. These buffalo are everywhere. Where did it go? Go away! <laughs> Sorry, baby. <laughs> Sorry, wife. How can I not stop shouting? It, you, you, are you watching? <laughs> Golly. Okay, back to this. Uh, so these need that needed to be hit with the buckshot because it's very small. Um, that sucks. Class two. Okay, so that's we know these are little tiny things. Look at that. I'm not going to keep that because I screwed the trophy up, but that that's I wanted to see what it looked like because what is a munchak? So um, anyway, that was pretty cool. Class two, size two. Yeah, so that sh the buckshot covers two to four, uh, and that's I should have shot it with buckshot. Oh, oh, well, but there you go. You get to see one. Too bad it, it wasn't a good score. It still would have been a great score, but it would have been. Let's see. It would have no. It still would have been. It would have been a silver. Oh well. So that's cool. Let's get to see one more new animal. There's still some more out there. Um, but if you're watching on YouTube, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a great night. Be sure to subscribe. Thumbs up, always help. I'll do a second video with the rest of the animals. See you next time. Bye.